Hello everybody, I'm Nasty Mold, and today we're going to be doing the daily quests and also finding all four hidden seasonal candle bundles throughout this area. We have four to find today. Collecting all four will give us one full seasonal candle. Our first one is just over here on the right hand side. Each one should give us about 25% of the seasonal wax needed to forge a seasonal candle. So now we're going to head back down. Well, me just dragging my feet everywhere. We're gonna head down because the rest of the stuff is all below. Just before the door here, we have our second seasonal candle bundle. And then we're just gonna sneak through the door and fly over the next one for our last two. So fly over and then stop right as soon as you fly over because the third one is right here under this gazebo. Now we just have one last one to find, which is very easy. It's just at the end of the Shiver Spirit here. And that is all the seasonal candles. Remember, collecting all four will give us one full seasonal candle. Now with that done, let's get started on today's daily quests. For today's quest, we have knock over five crabs, admire the sapling, collect the orange light, and relive the face palm spirit. So first off, we are going to admire the sapling, which is just over here towards the left side. All we have to do is wait underneath it for 60 seconds. If you open the quest menu, you can actually see the seconds tick off. So I'm just going to sit down and I will see you guys when this is done. Nice, admire the sapling is done. Now let's go relive the facepalm spirit, which can be found in this area just past the two gates once again. And this one's open, which is very nice. Oh no, my daily light reset. All right, so we're just gonna go towards the left-hand side. Uh, behind the back of the tree house here, we have the face palm spirit. Pretty easy to relive, but just watch your um, light because it is raining here. With that spirit done, our next stop is the Broken Bridge area, which is the final area just before the temple. However, I'm going to take the shortcut through the treehouse here. If you don't have the shortcut, just go straight until you reach the Broken Bridge. But if you do have the shortcut, this is how we get there. We're going to go through that door and then take the furthest door, which is this one here. It should open like a little slab above. It's a bit hard to see. If you don't have those shortcuts unlocked, you can always do them by completing the Season of Assembly quests. The only downside with those quests is that you do need quite a few people to help you complete them. So this is the Broken Bridge area. We're just going to fly all the way towards the left-hand side of the area, and we can see the orange light is flying just above. I usually like to stop on this little uh, glowing fungus mushroom thing over here. What are they called? Light blooms. I land on this one and recharge a little bit. And then I usually will fly up to this one. Sorry, there's going to be a little mute in a second. I forgot to put my phone into do not disturb mode, so I got a few texts. And I know that sound can be super distracting, so a couple mutes instead of big dings. Now with that quest done, we are now going to head back home and into the Golden Wasteland. That's where I find it easiest to flip some crabs. You can also flip some in this area, but they're pretty scattered and they're usually flipped by the time you get there.
So we're just gonna fly over here to the crab field and we're gonna let a, a giant scream which will knock over at least five crabs. And there we go, knock over five dark creature crabs. That is it for today's quests in the Hidden Forest. Thank you so much, as always, for watching, you guys. Hope you found this helpful. I hope you enjoyed. And I will see you in the next one. Bye-bye!